everyone, welcome back. All right, today we are gonna have fun with some Wet n Wild Halloween makeup and a huge shout out to Wet n Wild for sponsoring this video, I appreciate that. And ladies and gentlemen, <clears throat> check the description bar below, I have a link for you and a discount of 25% off your order because you know you can order direct from Wet n Wild. And don't forget they're also available at Walgreens, <clears throat> Um, Ulta, major real, re, uh, your retailers in your area. So it will be different stores for everyone. But this is from the Halloween collection, and they sent me over a few products. <clears throat> I'm going to show you some of the products I already have from the Halloween collection, and we're going to have some fun because we like to have fun here. Okay, um, on my face is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in Amber Beige. That's my perfect match. Love this foundation. And then the goodies they sent over are one of the new sponges. Now this is, I already wet it, so it's a little bigger, nice and squishy. They sent over two of the paint palettes. So this is the brights. And this is the neutrals. Uh, three of the Color Icon Shade Shifting Blushes in Ghoul, which is a purple. Zombie Blush, which is the greenish black greenish one kind of, and then Vampy, which is a uh, peachy pinky shade. <clears throat> and we're going to swatch everything too for you real quickly. And three of the Liquid Cat Suit lipsticks. Love these. This is in the shade Grave Problems. Also have Hexalent, nice Vampy Red, and Perfect for Halloween, uh, Blood Bank, nice orange. Okay. Let me get you some swatches real quick. We'll do the blushes first. I've already played with everything and been having a little fun and going to do a little look for you. And yeah, why not, right? Okay, so let me get all three here. So this is Ghoul. And this is right here. I'm going to try to smudge them out on my hand like I usually do for like blushes and highlighters. Right there. And we'll do the. Uh, Vampy, which is this red one. This has a beautiful shift to it also, like an orangey golden shade. Right there. And then the last one is the zombie blush. Get one there. Right here. You might be able to see the shifts. I'm not sure if you can or not, but they're there. They're there. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, the paint palettes. What's it called? Yes, the paint palettes. Just so you know, on the back of the packaging, it says it's not for use around the eyes. So I just want to put that disclaimer out there. What you do with it is up to you. You have six shades here. Now these are cream, so they little bit goes a long, long way. There are the first four. You can apply them with your fingers, brushes. Oh, I just mixed them together. My bad. And there's like a and an orange. Right there. And we'll do the brights real quick. Got a purple. Love this blue, a hot pink. I need this blue, wet and wild. <laughs> and a eyeliner. Those three there. I'll show you the bottom three. Got a lavender, a baby pink, and a royal blue. Now, if you want these to set, you're going to have to use a setting powder to set them because they will stay creamy, just so you know. Okay. Being that I am a beauty person, blogger, influencer, creator, whatever you'd like to call me, I'm going to make fun of beauty people <laughs> because I'm a beauty person. I can say that. <laughs> okay. I watch plenty of beauty videos, as we all do. I do get raised with me like four times a week. You've seen me do them multiple times. I rarely, will you'll ever see me do like the contour, the bronze. I usually have foundation and the basics done before I start to get ready with me just because my camera gives me about 20 minutes. But we're going to play anyway. 
Uh, a couple other the Halloween items before I forget about them is the limited editions. These here. Uh, the Caught in Your Web has a purple shift. And the Not Your Basic Witch uh, stays black. Now I do have a swatch videos up on both of those. I know the Boo Crew and this highlighter are in one video. And it's probably just a separate swatch video for the Wizards in Training, but I also think I have a Get Ready With Me using that also. We're going to play with the stuff they sent. So, here we go. Let's just have some fun. All right. We've got just a flat kind of contour brush here. And we're just going to go in. So I'm going to dip into the deep brown and this lighter brown next to it. Just kind of even split the pan with the brush right here. Because you can mix these shades together. So, beauty blender, or beauty blender, beauty time. I'm not making fun of anyone in, in particular. Just having fun here, like we always do. So you know how they all love to, got to carve it out. Got to, got to carve that all out. Oh, don't, don't, don't forget this area. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Got to get that jawline. Don't want to miss your jawline. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Give me a big flat brush here. Just got a flat brush. I'm going to go in with this shade here because every beauty guru but me. <laughs> you know, you got to brighten this up. Brighten it. Don't forget to brighten it. Got to brighten that up. Take a pat your face. And then, you know, we might as well color correct while we're here and go into a little bit of yellow and the orange. Because, you know, got, got, got to cover up those bags underneath your eyes. Don't forget those. Uh, what else we got here? Oh, boy. It's another flat brush. Going to go back into the browns. And you don't, you don't want to get slim that nose down. Slimmer. Probably made it wider, but that's all right. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, what else we got here? Oh, well, we got a bronze up, too. So... Go into that beautiful red brick shade. Oh, yeah. And we're just going to throw that right on with the other stuff. And blend it all in at once. Oh, yeah. Gotta bronze it up, baby. Bronze it. We we'll use a sponge. This, this got really big. <laughs> but you could mix, you could do this with your hands also if you wanted to. We're just going to have some fun here. The sponge is wet. And I'm just pressing her in and since it's a cream I'm gonna kind of wipe it too because I can you know what I'm doing here yeah carving it out carving it out get that jawline oh yeah gotta make those cheekbones pop you know how it is don't forget the nose. Don't forget that nose. I'm going to take a big fat brush for that. And under the eyes. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to put it right on. We can use it as eyeshadow base. Blend that baby in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Now, as I said, it's not meant for the eye area, but I'm a rebel. Okay. All right. So that I'm all bronze goddess. All that, yeah. Okay. Another way to have fun is use a. This is a disposable mascara wand. You can even take any of your mascaras that are old, and you know, just wipe it off. And dip it in here. So we're going to do one purple. I'm just rubbing this right into here. Just picking up a little bit on the brush. Zoom me in. You don't have no problem zooming in here. And then just apply it to your brows. And now you have purple brows. Fun, right? I'm going to flip it over, and we'll go into the pink shade, the hot 
pink will go on this side. Make sure I get out of here. I can kind of see what I'm doing on the monitor. There you go. I got some nice fun pink brow action going on. And the way I can set these is I can use the purple one, which is ghoul. Just a flat eyeshadow brush. Any eyeshadow brush you got. I'm gonna dip it in and I'm just gonna tap it over the top. And it'll help that cream product, you know, stay in place where it's at. And then for the pink one, I will use Vampy, this one here, just flipping the brush over. And we're just going to press that into the eyebrow area. Just to hopefully set it. Like I said, the cream products will not set, so if you have a translucent powder, however you want to do it. These also make a very pretty eyeshadow. I'll show you on the other eye. Yeah. You guys see what I'm doing here. Use your fingers, you can use a brush, however you want to do it. And I'll just I'll put the purpley one on the other eye. Get my finger in there, and there we go. Okay. Well, we might as well use the blush as a blush, right? Okay. I'll back up some more. This is Vampy, and since we have Vampy on this side, we'll just do it over here, a little bit on the cheek. Oh yeah. Very pretty. And then we can have some fun with the purple, which is ghoul. Same brush, I'm just running right over it. Now, ghoul might make you look like you got punched in the face. <laughs> it has that purple tinge to it. There. But this shade's very wearable. <laughs> Lippies. Let's try this one, which is excellent. Shake it up. Make a little mirror here. That's a lot of time to dry. My glasses down. Come on. Okay. Make sure I'm not blocking you. Okay. And you can overdraw your lips. You can go nuts with these. <laughs> I'm going to take a little bit of the Grave Problems and kind of pop that in the center. A little, little ombre action. Now, another uh, product of mine that I do have is the oh, Loose Highlighter from Wet n Wild and You Glow Girl, which is unbelievably pigmented. Right there. Do a little bit of my hand over here. So, we, we got to glow. We got to glow. I'll do swatches of lipsticks for you, too. So, we're going to go into that highlighter. Just on a fluffy brush. And, oh, got to do the nose. Oh, yeah. Because, you know, that nose ain't glowing. And then what's it? A little pure, usually. A little fun over here. Oh, yeah. Get that glow going. Glow, baby, glow. Oh, yeah. It's an incredible highlighter. Oh, got a little lip. Don't want to forget the lip. Okay. 
gotta, gotta, gotta have that glow. And then once they're a little up here, usually, oh yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna, gonna glow to the gods. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm glowing. I'm glowing. Oh yeah, chin too. Don't don't forget the chin. Sometimes down their whole nose. Yeah. <laughs> it's makeup. Just always have fun with it. It's just makeup. It washes off. You can see the sponge is great though. No issues there at all. And, you know, want to tone it down a little. Blend it in. Did I play with everything here? Oh, let me give you swatches of the lipsticks. Ah, uh, blood bank. Orange shade. There's blood bank. Excellent. <laughs> That's a great. That is a me shade without a doubt for those of you that watch my videos all the time. And this is a beautiful shade too. Uh, grave problems. It's like a purpley uh, gray shade, which I love also. There's those. And for those of you that haven't seen swatches of this highlighter, which is Cottoner Web. This has the little skull on it also. And this does a beautiful purple highlight. Purple. And for those of you that are bold and daring more than I am, you have this one here, which is not your basic witch. Again, we have the little skull head. And this, it's black shimmer. So, you know, you need black, perfect. And you can, it's, you can use these as eyeshadow, without a doubt. It has some sparkle in it. So say you want to, you know, go into the eye area. Mess with the brush. My bad. I always use highlighters as eyeshadows. So that's definitely something you can do. I don't know. Let me grab the other side here. Still the brush. And you can put the purple highlight in between there. Over here, oh yeah. And even with you know the palettes like this, you can any kind of brush you have. Let's see what I got here. A nice thin brush. Product on it. Just a flat brush. You know, go into, and you can mix these colors too. Go into the blue, grab a little bit of the pink, and this is where you can draw things, say. Yeah, well, nice little, nice little heart. Go into the blue and the baby pink. And also you want to do a lightning bolt. And that's the blue and the baby pink mixed. So see, you can change things just by changing the color. Going to the baby blue and the purple. Another heart. Take some deep purple, fill it in. It's just makeup. Just have fun with it. And even the blushes too. These here, you can use as a lip topper. Oh, we're going to take Vampy. Just going to put on my finger. I'll zoom you up. And totally change the color of the lipstick. Have fun. Play. Happy Halloween, everyone. Like I said, check the description box below. I will have a link for you and a 25% off code. Uh, I can tell you the promo code 
right now, just in case you don't want to look below, uh, W-W-E-H-M-I-E-0-2-Z. And I will put the link, like I said, down below for you and that code. So you can save 25% off at Wet n Wild. And another great item to pick up if you're on there, pick up the Wet n Wild 40 palette. 40 shades, only $20. I got plenty of videos below doing get readies with me and swatches of it. All right, everyone have a fabulous day. Happy Halloween and have some fun and just play. Don't leave makeup. Love y'all. See y'all soon.